Hi YouTube, welcome to my channel and welcome to my first video. If you guys clicked on this video, I definitely want to say a big thank you. Now, I originally wasn't going to do a voiceover, I was just going to let some music play, but I figured since it's my first video, why not give a little info about myself, my channel, and my art. So by watching the video, you guys could see it's pretty easy and simple to burn, but that's mainly because I'm doing something easy. The easier the sketch, the easier it is to burn. And let me just say, if you're an artist who knows how to do art freehand, you're blessed. That is something difficult a lot of artists like myself struggle with. I always at least outline what it is I want to draw and fill in the details later. A lot of my supplies are from Michaels, which is very affordable, and that's a good thing for beginners. Guys, you will always find yourself growing your skills, energy, and knowledge as long as you keep creating. It's not about starting with the best or most expensive tools. Just be comfortable with starting small and discovering if it's for you. And if it is, then you'll slowly build a strong commitment with your work and level things up. This is one of my favorite parts I enjoy doing when I complete a wood burning piece. Not because my work is nearly done, but I feel this is what makes half of my art complete, which is putting resin on it. I feel it brings it to life, gives it that glow and a beautiful contrast. And a lot of people in wood burning, I notice they don't put resin on their artwork which I fully understand because maybe for texture, the wood surface, or just the art itself how it has more of a vintage look. But I just love how this is that extra layer that will protect the artwork and it gives it that beautiful shine which you guys will see in the end. Also, when I'm done spreading the resin and getting rid of the bubbles, I let my art sit for the rest of the day and overnight, I find it's easier to let the resin do its work close for at least 20 hours. Right here I'm just putting my custom made logo on the wood piece. If you guys sell art, which I've sold many pieces without my signature on it, that's something you definitely want to do so people are able to share who created the art. Here's the finished product. I'm so happy with how these turned out. These were actually my first time working with these little guys. But other than that, I just want to say thank you to everybody who watched this video. You could definitely expect to see more just like this from me. My channel is to educate those who are beginners and those who just enjoy videos like this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and subscribe for more videos like this. I will see you guys in my next video.